Well, as you no doubt saw, the president's former personal attorney, Michael Cohen, pleaded guilty yesterday to a number of criminal charges, but some of them stemmed from a payment that he made to porn star Stormy Daniels. For that and other things, he is facing three to five years in prison. You're hearing cable news that this could be the death knell of the Trump administration, and who knows what lies ahead. But it does raise a number of interesting questions about the crime itself, beginning with, was it a crime? Huh. Chris Hahn joins us tonight to sort this out. Chris, thanks a lot uh, for coming on tonight. Anytime. So, I mean, I, I guess 20, if I'd asked you 20 years ago, do you think that you'd be leading the charge to remove a president from office over his sex life? You, <laughs> you probably wouldn't have found thought that you would ever find yourself here. But let me ask you this. If you are approached by someone who says, give me money or I will embarrass you, isn't that extortion? It is extortion, and I have no problem with the president's sex life. I think only Melania Trump should have a problem with his sex life if she does. But that said, okay. what the president is being accused of is directing Michael Cohen to commit a federal election crime, which is a felony. Right. And if but, that but, is but, true, but, uh, well, this is no, something wait, on, Congress should investigate. It, it, it may or may not be a, a, a federal election crime. It may or may not be a felony. Most are civil offenses, as you know. But let's just get back to the core event here. Stormy Daniels apparently said to Donald Trump through his attorney, give me money or I will embarrass you. Now, you just conceded that, that is extortion. If that happened to you, I think you would consider it extortion. I know I would if it happened to me. Why do we not consider it extortion in this case? Why are we celebrating her lawyer, celebrating her? You just said it was extortion. Well, I don't Shouldn't know. Shouldn't someone get on this? I, I don't know. I don't know that Stormy Daniels said, give me money or I will tell. I think Tor Stormy Daniels said, I will tell. And the president said, wait, let me give you money so you don't tell, which is what happened with Catherine McDougal and which oh, may have happened with wait, others. Wait, wait, and I no, think we're going to find wait, wait, out. Hold on, but hold on. I, so I don't wait, think. Hold on. Wait, stop. Wait, stop for one second here. So you're saying what we already know, which is. She took money in order to remain silent, which means that if she hadn't taken money, she talked anyway, of course. But the implication is, I mean, Trump doesn't like to spend money on anything, as you know, the cheapest man in the world. Yeah. Well, he He's got not a bad deal. She didn't say she, stay quiet. Well, all right. But 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 the deal was extortion. So, I mean, look, I'm not defending this. I don't think the president's telling it, the truth about it. it. I think extortion. he probably did have a relationship with her. I'm not like, okay, but it's still extortion. Yeah. Tucker. So, like, why are we excusing Tucker. that? I, it's a serious, sincere question. Tucker, it, it's, it's extortion if she asked him for the money. It's not no, extortion no, if he offers her no, the money. No, no. So let's be you, clear oh, you here. Just think, and the president no, of the no, United States, this is the ridiculous. crime, the the president's crime, like, oh, I, I crime give you here money. is not extortion. The crime <laughs> uh, is directing no, I, somebody to commit a crime. It, and who knows what else we're going to find wait, out. Wait, but hold on. Wait, let, me just, let me just ask you. So the idea here, and it's a, it's a stupid idea, I, I would say, is that this was a campaign contribution. And so the implication is that right. if it had come out that Trump had a relationship with a porn star, people would have been totally shocked and wouldn't have voted for him because that just doesn't sound like the Donald Trump they knew. I mean, that's like ridiculous, <laughs> actually. This wasn't a campaign contribution. Well, that's what this the, was hush money well, well, paid you know, to a porn star. And like, that's what it is. It's not a crime, it's embarrassing. I mean, honestly. According to what we heard in court yesterday, according. According to what we heard in court yesterday, the president was concerned that this and other things would come out, and he directed Michael Cohen to commit well, a sure campaign finance violation. That is no, but, different but on, than collecting would, a little bit too but, much but money. On. How he, is the it, candidate it, himself how is it a directed, campaign? if that's well, true? I, I got it. I, I read the newspapers. I, I watch all the other channels. It's a campaign fine. How is it a campaign finance violation? Speak slowly so I can understand. How is this a campaign donation? This is a payment to a former girlfriend. How is that a campaign donation? Anything, anything gained of value in a campaign is a campaign donation. That is very clear oh, in campaign oh, finance Oh, is that true? Law. So anything if my stock value. portfolio, well, no, no, no. That's, that's actually not the giving law. Money we, to not, somebody, not, giving money to somebody no, no, no. for something of value is definitely, a, it's an in-kind it, no, campaign. It's, it's over not. the limit. No, it's okay. No, it's it not. Is. That is what what you just said is factually well, untrue. If when I run, not, wait, hold on. if I run if for office, I wait. Hold on, let me finish my yeah. sentence. If I run for office, I do not relinquish my right to make money. 
If I mow your lawn and I'm running for the Senate and you pay me for that, that's not, that's not a campaign contribution. Not all money a candidate takes is a campaign contribution. How is a payment to an old girlfriend a campaign <laughs> contribution? It's not. I mean, like how? Because Michael Cohen, seconds, Michael, Cohen, Michael Cohen paid that money to avoid the embarrassment the last days of the campaign at the right. direction of the candidate, if that's true. Well, and if that happens, that. that is a campaign finance violation. No, and it but, is particularly but it's also, egregious wait, hold on. because the candidate it's, himself directed it. It's a, but of course he directed it. Of course, I, I don't care what they say. Of course he did. He's a married man with kids. Then he's guilty. He slept with a porn star. He says to he's guilty of doing what like 50 people I know have done, it's, which is done something awful, and you pay the person off. But I think it's extortion. President. It's incredibly common, as you know. No, he was a candidate, and he still has a wife Look, and kids. How is that a campaign contribution? It's not. It's an effort there, to keep your there girlfriend is a from lawyer. talking. There is a lawyer is so who stupid. went in federal court yesterday and swore an oath that right. it was for the campaign. That is what the president is dealing with, and that's what Congress even know should what be investigating means. right okay. now. Okay, they should impeach him then. Well, let's Congress should investigate it. Congress should do its job and All get right. to the bottom of it. <laughs> get to the bottom of it. We already got to the bottom of it. He paid off his girlfriend and got they, caught. That's the bottom of it. It's so, it's so dumb, I can't even deal with it. We're out of I don't time. think Chris, it's the bottom. I think it's just the surface. We'll no, see. No, there's more. There's more. Yeah, right. There's more. No, he paid off his girlfriend. Please. There's no more.